because what I discovered, there are these settings here, uh, and these are in Windows, um, and the settings are show cursor, and let me use my pen as a mouse when it's available. And there's a couple other ones here too. I got here by looking for the pen and ink settings. Uh, there, there it is, pen and ink. Okay, um, but as you can see, it doesn't seem to make a difference. And um, one of the things that the person that I chatted with on Microsoft said is it depends on the manufacturer of the PC. And this is one of the little tricks that GMK Tech had in store for me, I discovered, it seems. I don't know what else it could be other than that. Uh, and it is what uh, Microsoft said, that uh, it's the it's the manufacturer. So, um, I mean, I, I bought this PC for this reason, you know. Uh, I wanted to be able to play games, sure. Uh, yeah, absolutely, I wanted to be able to play games. Um, but I, I wanted it for productivity. I wanted it for this. And I can't use this. I can't. It's just one of the things that either I'll have to accept or, um, or you know, get a different PC. I'm going to try other programs, I guess. I don't really want to, though. Um, and I don't, I don't know why um, they'd be any different than this one. Uh, so. Um, I'm thinking I'm just gonna end up sending this back, and that'll be the fourth freaking computer. And you know, when I started buying these computers, it's it, each one of these computers I bought, and there are four of them. I asked, "Can this uh, computer support a, a touch screen?" Is what I asked, you know. And um, I didn't know the difference between a touch screen and a pen display, you know, but. Um, but this is one of the things that I guess I'll have to ask when buying a computer. I mean, it sounds ridiculous, but I'll have to ask, will the show cursor be removed? Or, or, or I don't even know how to say it. How will I phrase this appropriately? Uh, will the, does the show cursor option in the pen and windows ink display work? <laughs> you know, they'll, they'll just, you know, they'll look at me like I'm crazy, uh, look at the email like I'm crazy, so I, I don't know, I, I, I don't know what to do then about this, um, uh, and, and then there's this, you know, there, there are all kinds of mysteries with, with using this program, no doubt about it, uh, I find that when I, uh, was using the mouse and then come back here, it does this. You see how the lines are connecting? I think when I click on the mouse, see the yeah, see the mouse is doing this. The mouse is active, you know, like it's it's dragging and drawing. I think so yeah, I clicked on it again and it stopped. Maybe that has something to do with it. I don't know. I guess I kind of don't mind the idea of experimenting with it and finding out how to fix it I sort of enjoy doing that sort of thing <clears throat> but not when there's a $700 or $800 PC on the line and another $200 tablet this is this is a thousand dollars for me to tinker with something that should work when I uh, could be using it for what I intended it to, instead I'd be using it uh, as a as a gnome tinkering, and uh, you know that's fine, like I said, but it's not what I wanted, and I'm gonna stop now.